I'm here walking with Samimi, exploring the original Von Kraft family home here in Salzburg. Quite different from the one in the movie. We all went in and look around the mansion grounds. The 1965 movie, The Sound of Music, is based on the Von Kraft family of Salzburg. As we walk, here is the history of the Von Kraft family singers. Let's begin with the patriarch. Georg Von Kraft was born in 1880, became a national hero as a captain in the Austrian Navy during World War I. He commanded submarines with valor and received the title of Ritter, Knight, and later Baron for his accomplishment. In 1912, Georg married Agatha Whitehead, the granddaughter of Robert Whitehead, the inventor of torpedo. They had seven children together, Rupert, Agatha, Maria, Werner, Hedwig, Johanna, and Martina. After the war, Austria lost all of its seaports, and Georg retired from the Navy. His wife died in 1922 due to scarlet fever, and the family was devastated and unable to bear in living in a place where they had been so happy. Georg sold his property in Pula and bought an estate in Salzburg. Maria Augusta Kutsera was born in Vienna in 1905. She was orphaned as a young child and had a miserable childhood. While attending a school in Vienna, she accidentally attended a Palm Sunday service, believing it to be a concert of back music where a priest was singing. Soon after, Maria graduated, and because of her religious awakening, she entered the Benedictine Abbey of Nonnenberg in Salzburg as a novice. When Georg approached the Reverend Mother, seeking a teacher for his sick daughter, Maria was chosen. She was supposed to stay for 10 months. In the end, she will formally enter the convent. Maria tutored young Maria and developed a caring and loving relationship with all the children. She enjoyed singing with them and getting them involved in outdoor activities. During this time, Georg fell in love with Maria and asked her to stay with him and become a second mother to his children. Maria and Georg were married in 1927. They had three children together Rosemary, Eleanor, and Johannes. The family lost most of its wealth through the Worldwide Depression when their bank failed in the early 1930s. Maria dismissed most of the servants and taking in boarders. It was around this time that they began considering making a family hobby of singing into a profession. But Georg was reluctant for the family to perform in public. They made the acquaintance of a young priest, Dr. Franz Wasner, who encouraged their musical progress and bought them sacred music to add to the folk songs, madrigals, and ballads they were already singing. As depicted in the movie Sound of Music, the family won first prize in the Salzburg Music Festival of 1936 and became successful. Along with Dr. Wasner, they toured across Europe. When the Nazis annexed Austria in 1938, the Von Krups realized they were in trouble. Georg not only refused to fly the Nazi flag on their house, he also declined a naval command and a request to sing at Hitler's birthday party. They were also becoming aware of Nazis' anti-religious propaganda and policies and the brainwashing of children against their parents. They thought of staying in Austria and taking advantage of the enticements the Nazis were offering. Greater fame as a singing group, a medical doctor's position for Rupert, and a renewal naval career for Georg. Against leaving behind everything they knew, their friends, family, estate, and all of their possessions, 
they decided they could not compromise their principles and left for the United States. So that ends the Vontra family saga in Austria. As for the house, it is very different from the one in the movie. It's a 22-room historic house built in 1863. During the annexation of Austria, Heinrich Himmler used the home as his summer residence, converting one of the children's rooms to his office and installing a barracks for SS officers in the grounds. After the war, a religious group, the Catholic missionaries of the Precious Blood, bought the property from the Von Trapps, who had their ownership restored after the Nazis were defeated. The priest rented out the property in the 1990s and it became a hotel in 2008. Now guests can stay in rooms that belong to the various members of the Von Trapp family. So that's it for the history of the Von Trapp family in Austria and the Villa Von Trapp. Stay tuned in case I end up visiting the Von Trapp Lodge in Vermont. Till next time, don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe. Bye! So guys, if you like our videos, please subscribe to our channel. And feel free to comment. Hit the bell, hit the bell, hit the bell, hit the bell, come on guys, hit the bell! For notifications. And don't forget to share! And like!